They said they were on their way. They should be here by now. Of course, sweetheart. They'll be home soon, okay? Oh, Victoria. Mother and I will take care of you now, okay? I have the tea kettle on. You want something to eat? Okay, maybe later. Proud of you, son? You said you'd bring your sister home, and you did. You want to take a bath? You want to just crawl into bed? I'd like to see Johnny. Is he sleeping? He is, but his dreams will be sweeter now that his mommy's home. Come on, we'll go see him. You pack your things and get out, all right? I don't ever want to see you. Yeah, my daughter again. This is my house. Upstairs is my wife. This is the one place you don't get to throw your weight around with me. Vic is home and she's safe. There's no more guys with guns. I'm gonna go home and see my kids, but let me say this, Dad. We busted in that door in Miami and Billy was right there with me. He didn't care what was on the other side. He would have given his life for Victoria and that's gotta mean something certainly means something to me. You can follow him now, okay? My mistake was a long time ago. It was before Hong Kong, before I knew your daughter was gonna be my wife. I screwed up, I know it. It came back to bite me. No, Billy Boyd came back to bite Victoria. You're the one who should have had a gun to his head. I would have done anything to trade places with her. I would have spent a year in that hole so she wouldn't have to spend a second. I would have given anything to get her home safe. Do you know how furious I am with you? You're responsible for Victoria being kidnapped. Your stupidity, your arrogance, you thought you'd handle it on your own. You couldn't, could you now? You stay away from my daughter. Or else I'll let her know that you knew all along about my whereabouts in Los Angeles. And she'll know you for the kind of fellow you are. Victoria just got home. She's still traumatized. She's still shivering. And you want to tell her that now? Really? You have caused my daughter nothing but sadness and sorrow and unhappiness. And a stolen child. And a pregnant mistress. Yeah, who you sent after me. And then you're responsible for her kidnapping. But I'm partly guilty. Because I failed to tell her that you knew of my whereabouts in Los Angeles all along. Had I told her, she would have left you then. None of this nonsense in Miami would have happened. I have a choice. You leave her now, or I'll make sure that she leaves you. You want some time with your daughter? Take it. Why don't you use that time to help her rest? I'm gonna go now, but I will be back. You will be back to pack your things. Now get going, son. You're not saving her, you know. You're hoarding her. Newman got ripped from your hands and now you're just gathering all your possessions around you. Victoria's just another thing that you think you own. Get out. Feeling, my sweetheart. Hmm? Johnny is just 
so beautiful <laughs> little face. Where's Billy? Yes, where could he have gone? You should eat something or maybe have some tea. No, I'll just, um, I'll eat when I'm hungry, okay? We just want to help you get through this, honey, no matter what. Where's Billy? He, uh, he left. Why? Sweetheart, he knows he failed you. And for the first time, he's actually ashamed. He must never put you in harm's way again. I'm, um, I'm just really tired right now. Okay. Do you two mind? Honey, let me take you back upstairs. Mom and I will wait for you down here, I just, okay? I, I, I would really just like to be alone right now. You mean you don't want us to be here? Just... No, I don't. You understand, right, Mom? I just want to be alone. Billy! Hey, what a nice surprise. Can I fix you some leftovers? Jack, you remember your clever plan. Fake me and Victoria out. Send her on a lark to Miami. Uh, listen, I've been trying to call you. I, I think we need to talk. I'd love to have a good conversation with you about this, you and Victoria. I don't think Victoria's gonna be up to chatting with you since your little trick got her kidnapped and almost killed. Eddie's lying face down in his own blood in one room. Victoria's in the other. And the entire time, I'm thinking I just lost the woman that I can't live without. But the authorities eventually showed up and arrested this... Max? Yeah, they did. But only after he had Eddie terrorize my wife at gunpoint. And then she had the added bonus of seeing him get gunned down right in front of her. Jack, brother, you hit the jackpot. Whoa, 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 whoa. I hate that Victoria was in danger. But let's be straight about this. This is about your screw-ups, your gambling. I bailed you out in a big way before you went off to Hong Kong. I'd have covered this debt, too, if I'd known anything about it. Victoria going to Miami was all about you giving her confidential information so she could steal Newman back from me. You set me up. I gave you a chance to prove your loyalty. You screwed it up. I screwed it up. You know, it wasn't enough for you to fire me. My wife had to get caught in the fallout, and probably my marriage, too, Jack. I feel for Victoria. She's been through a lot, and obviously the two of you are going to go through a great deal more, and I will be there for you in any way that I can. But I can't do that if you continue to pretend that this is somehow my fault. Pretend? You think I'm pretending? I'm not Billy, pretending. don't oh, do that. Whoa! Happy Thanksgiving. Hide the carving knife. What is all this about? Everything's just, just fine, right, Billy? Heads up, buddy. Your dad hasn't thrown you under the Newman Enterprises bus yet. But he will. Because it's a known fact that you aren't a real Abbott until you have tire marks all over your face. Right, Jack?
Get away! Hey, hey, hey! Get away! Hey, it's me! It's me! Get away! It's me! It's me! It's me! You're okay, you're safe. Get away. You're safe, honey. You're safe. You're safe. <laughs> Nobody can hurt you. Nobody can hurt you. This is all my fault. Everything they're saying, blaming me, it's true. That guy would hurt you. I need you to forgive me. Can you forgive me? <laughs>